A female Brainerd High School staff member was attacked from behind in the girls' locker room at the school this morning. The woman suffered minor injuries in the attack, and a suspect is in custody. Anthony Scott has more details on the story. Before most of the students arrived at Brainerd High School this morning, a 36-year-old female Brainerd staff member was doing her job in the locker room when suddenly she was grabbed from behind. The original description was that he was wearing all black or dark clothing. The staff member fought back against her attacker, freeing herself, and started yelling for help. We're really fortunate that she fought off this person and that she wasn't hurt worse than she is. Once the intruder no longer had control of the situation, he started fleeing the scene, and a witness recognized the alleged attacker as 20-year-old Jared Allen Tristan McCormick. The Brainerd Police Department was contacted at 648 this morning, and McCormick was under arrest about 15 minutes later. Authorities apprehended him as he was walking down the street about three quarters of a mile away from the school. McCormick is believed to be a former student at Brainerd High School, but it is unknown if he had any relationship with the victim. I'm standing in front of the Brainerd High School main entrance, which is the only door that is unlocked during the school day. However, in between the time when custodians arrive until school starts, most doors in the building are open. We have many people that come in and use the weight room, many people that come in and use the swimming pool. There's all kinds of activities that are being offered along with the sports practices. Brainerd schools have already had a meeting and some security changes are being made before the school day starts. We made a few changes starting immediately and that is that the locker rooms are going to be locked until a certified person that can be there to supervise um, has access to those lockers. And also we're asking everyone that if they do come in to work in the weight, weight, work out in the weight room or in the swimming pool to always have a partner to use the buddy system. Superintendent Larson also said the school is doing their own investigation to prevent this from happening in the future and the school is just happy that the victim is okay. We're just so thankful that our staff member is okay and we're going to do everything that we can to support her and to increase the safety and security for all of our students and our staff. One of the things that we really pride ourselves in is that we're a family here and that we take care of each other and when one of our family members is hurt, um, it, it's very hard on everyone. Reporting from Brainerd, Anthony Scott, Lakeland News. The suspect in the case, Jared McCormick, is currently being held at the Crowan County Jail pending formal charges. If you enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland PBS.